In this episode, I'm going to show you how Blazor Plate enables users to build up their profiles by uploading a profile picture and adding some basic information. So let's go to the user account settings. From the avatar tab, I'm going to upload an avatar picture for my profile. Notice that I can rename the picture that I've just selected before uploading. After saving the form, the system will respond with a message indicating that the account has been updated successfully. This is a localized message generated by the backend server according to the user language preference. I will explain localization and multilingual support in more detail in the following episodes. Now let's go to the profile tab to add some basic information. Notice that the profile picture I've just uploaded is still not showing up. The reason is that the path of the profile picture is a part of the user's access token, which contains some other information, such as the roles and permissions assigned to the user. The only way to get the latest version of that information is to obtain a new access token. Therefore, I'm going to save this form, then, I'm going to log out and then log back into my account to force the authentication system to generate a new access token. The new access token should contain the most recent information related to my account, including the path of the profile picture, job title, first and last name. As we can see, the user profile picture is showing up alongside the full name and the job title. An access token is an object that the client application uses to make API requests securely on behalf of a user. In the following episodes, I will explain in more detail how the access token works in conjunction with other security-related features within Blazorplate's environment. Thank you for watching.